Hey everybody, Indigo Priestess here. Um, I know it's been two weeks, I haven't made any videos, it's just been really crazy, really busy, and I am back onto everything now, and I'm so glad to be back. Um, and I hope everybody's really doing awesome, and that you're growing from strength to strength, and that you see yourselves as God. So you guys saw the topic, Papa Legba, you know, the God of the Gateway. So, if you don't know, I do work with the lower, and um it's really awesome you know uh there's no real difference in my opinion people may be you know they might may, may um disagree with me but i've lived the experience i've lived to tell the story and everything that i speak of is that which i have already experienced so you know uh, with papa legba um i've noticed that um you know if there's something that is not right in your life you know um, every entity can basically make an amazing change in your life in a positive manner, you know, and as assist in certain areas of your life that perhaps, you know, another entity may not be too interested in enlightening you with um, or helping you and encouraging you in. You know, every entity has different traits to them and we have to respect that you know so with papa legba you know if you don't know papa legba can assist you you know with opening the doors to to success to wealth to spirit communication and to really great health you know papa legba if you feeling negative or there is just you feel like there's a curse over your life or even a generational curse papa legba can close those doors basically close the door to negativity you know a papa legba is the first urisha you know um called in any urisha ceremony without communication you know without him communication to to the lower would not be possible so he opens the way you know to to assist you and to help you in communicating with the other orishas and um, papa legba's favorite number is number three his day is monday so if i do an opening of the way with papa legba i normally do this you know on a monday in extreme cases i have done an opening of the way you know um close to midnight on a sunday evening and it has also worked just as well um just because these beings they do look to your heart what is the situation um there is a little bit more structure but that's because these beings like things done in a certain way so yeah with papa legba his day is monday his um, papa legba's colors are red black and sometimes white depending on his mood so it's really great to get to know the entity um you know papa legba is a loving entity um, but there is many sides to him so i should let you know that in my experience you know papa legba does enjoy rum cigars and candy as well as pennies um sometimes things don't have to make sense and what i notice when i work with papa legba i get extremely hungry after i've done his offerings made his food for him and um you know yams and and chicken and after i've, I've done all those things on his altar i get really hungry and uh, you know um you enjoy your food so much more and this is because sometimes he will enter you and you will enjoy certain foods even more than what you would um on other days you know he's also known as elegua for some of you who don't know that and before you work with papa legba um i i do encourage you to basically um learn more about santaria osha and um haruba tradition so yeah I, um, I I do encourage everybody, you know, if you if you are new to to Santeria or if you want to learn more, you know, on how to go to the next level, you know, be open, be open. Let there be no let there be no barriers, because I can be honest with you guys and say, and I've said it before, that yes, my foundation is um, um, Lucifer, and my patron is Belial. You know, some call him Belial, and I call Belial Belial um, from the beginning. And um, perhaps it's because I've been a while in the States that I seem to be adept into Belial. But Belial um, basically is my patron. And I must say, they have basically, you know, led me 
to this path um, but I'm not gonna say too much on my videos because you know Santeria when it comes to Santeria you know there's a lot of people fighting against each other so one thing I will say is that I'm still on my path with the Goetia beings with the ancient gods um, but that they have opened the doors and pushed me to move um, into Santaria and work with the lower um, so at a later stage I will explain a lot more um, basically but for now I'm going to keep it there and I thought it would be amazing for me to just um, give you guys a little bit of information on Papa Legba and what I know and um, a few things a little details on what I've experienced and just you know um, a little bit about opening the ways if you don't know what opening of the way working is uh, basically it's to open the ways you know in your life spiritually you know earthly every earthly need um, spiritually as well and you know also to allow you to work with um, the other Orishas so because you have to go through Papa Lepa, you know um, like I said when it comes to this um, practice there are a lot of opinions and we need to respect other people's opinions but you know and vice versa so this is what I've learned this is what I believe this is what works for me um, but like I said if this is something you guys would like to learn you can just email me and I do encourage you you know before you go into um, working with these amazing beings to just learn a bit more about Santeria and uh, Ocha and and the yoruba tradition it's really important that you you understand how to approach certain um practices um, before you go into it it's a lot more it's a bit different to to you know working with the goetia and working with with lucifer and and astroff and and um, belial but it is extremely rewarding and you learn so much so i hope you guys enjoyed this video i'm going to make a video on um, two other orishas as well and stay tuned like and subscribe if you have any questions pertaining to to um the lower feel free to email me just check my description box below and i'm more than happy to assist you ciao ciao